Welcome back to the channel, guys. We're gonna be doing things a little bit different today. Um, I'm planning on doing a vlog style video. Let me know in the comment section below, guys, if you like this style video that you see here today. Um, basically, it's gonna be like a day in the life of a real estate investor, of somebody that's actually going in and working on properties and improving them, increasing the value of them, just adding value to properties. Let me know if you like this style video. Um, today we have a lot of big things happening we have the drywall being delivered and drywall is going to be uh, installed tomorrow it's june 1st today super exciting to be having the drywall going up i'll show you what we're planning on doing here this is a really tough project um if you see this is the house behind us and we need to get drywall all the way up into this attic so as you can see, the windows have already been installed, those beautiful black windows. Um, the guys are gonna be ripping this window out, unfortunately, but that's the only way to get the drywall up there. Um, I'll show you because the stairway going up to the attic is way too tight. They're also gonna be taking this window out. Um, hopefully, I don't think they have to rip it right out, but maybe just pop the window out um to get the drywall on that floor and then everything else will be walked in on the main floor and then walk downstairs into the basement this is a whole house being drywalled so i'll be showing you guys the process on that and how everything goes uh, apparently they're going to be bringing like a, a little crane here to get everything up there which is super cool and yeah follow along today as i was saying guys there's the drywall. I'm up on the second floor right now. I don't think that's all of it. And they're also waiting for a crane. So, and that might be the crane down there. Anyways, guys, the reason why it's being craned is because look at that stairwell there. It is super tight. This is about two feet and there is not a lot of headroom to get up into the attic. So as we come up here, look at that beautiful attic. They're gonna be using this window right here. They're gonna actually, it sucks. This is a brand new window, but they're gonna be popping it out and craning all the way up here, which is gonna be kind of cool to see, but not cool that they're ripping out my beautiful window. So it is what it is. The guy in the crane is saying that they can't hit the attic now. That it's too far away. Let's see what happens. As I was just saying and as you saw they're setting up the spider crane but he's saying that he's not going to be able to reach um, up to the attic because <clears throat> the addition on the house is it protrudes too far so the reach on the boom is going to be too far um, anyways this guy just has a terrible attitude it's Monday morning the guy does not want to work um, you know I said just fucking do it like let's go enough enough excuses Check it out. I said enough excuses. Let's fucking get this job done. And uh, I had to call his boss and, and whatever. Then the next issue was that they say they don't pull out windows. And uh, we just had our windows freshly installed. So, you know, they don't want to do it. Um, I didn't really come prepared today to do it. But we need to get the job done. So I guess I'm pulling out a window and we'll see how that goes and uh yeah just I'm, I'm crossing my fingers here that he will be able to reach the attic i'll pull the window up myself and let's get this job done okay so this window was so hard to pull out there was spray foam shims so many hidden screws but i did eventually end up getting it out as you guys will see um thank goodness i had one of the workers actually come up and help me pull it out at the end maybe i'll let you go out first get on Awesome. 
thanks a lot, man. Yeah, no problem. Really appreciate that. Lean it back. I was just gonna check it out about it. It's fucked it up, but I'll do that the other day. Okay, wicked. That's gonna be one hell of a fucking 45 coming through that way. Yeah, do you know what the distance is? Corner to corner? So, um. It would have fit with uh, with the with the window in place, but the guy said I risk damaging the window, so to take it out, right? But oh, tons. What about up straight up and down? Sixty-two and forty-two, forty-one. Well, it's going to go on a bit of an angle, anyway. Forty-one. Yeah, maybe look at the soffit on the outside. There. Oh yeah. That's oh, this guy here. Yeah. Yeah. So he's going to have to go on that angle. Yeah. Oh, like come in, like. Yeah. You still got lots, but you just have to pull it on a mean angle. Well, at least you don't you don't worry about damaging anything out here. <laughs> Is that going to fall off that piece? Right. Not much. Oh, it's a special one. The window is out in one piece. Wow. First time ever taking in a window, especially on a third story. That was something else. Huge. In this clip here, I sped this up because I don't want to bore you guys, but this spider machine, it's in it's incredible. It's such a cool machine, but it moves so slow. drywall is up in the attic thank god these guys were able to get it up through this window or window opening I should say because that would have been a huge pain in the ass trying to get that up those stairs impossible more material being delivered. We got all the plywood that we're gonna be sheeting the floor with and some insulation and a bunch of other goodies. I got a lot of hand bombing to do here. We got that going on. We got drywall being delivered inside. Big day today. Okay guys, after hand bombing all these sheets of plywood, I wrapped up for the day. Had a nice round of golf. If you guys liked this style of video, please let me know in the comments section below, guys, so I know to continue doing this for you. If you have any suggestions, also leave it in the comments section below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and smash that like button, guys. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm. Thank you so much for watching. Until the next episode, take care, be safe. See you later.